58 year old and youth guy from Cameroon came with a history of stroke leading to left hemiplegia on advice of a friend he came to india for an advanced neuro rehabilitation the first time i go out of my country for treatment it it is good everything is good the the the, the equipment the 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 doctors are professional technologically advanced hospitals specialized doctors low cost treatments and e medical visa facilities have contributed to help india become one of the fastest growing medical tourism destinations in asia according to fiki imus report over 500000 foreign patients seek treatment in india each year they mostly come to india for heart surgery knee transplant cosmetic surgery and dental care as the treatment cost in india is considered lowest in asia patients who come in from the western world uh, where you have an nhs kind of model for example in the uk there is a lot of waiting period so we find that in patients from uk from the from the canadian um, agencies as well that they have to wait a long time so they tend to come for that secondly a large number of countries don't have the kind of services that we can provide uh, because they don't have the infrastructure for this thing india currently has around 18% of the global medical tourism's market in an estimate it can be a 9 billion worth us dollars medical tourism destination by having 20% global market share by 2020 A large number of patients in India come from South Asia, Africa, and CIS countries. All the NABH um, uh, approved hospitals have now put up their uh, um, charges and the list and all the facilities which they are giving. It is visible on the website, so it's a very transparent thing. Any any patient who is coming to India can go on that site and understand what are the kind of facilities being offered at what price. so they can choose where, where to go and how to go and we also have certain facilitation uh, counters set up at the major airports like mumbai delhi bangalore chennai etc to help those people who are coming for medical tourism dr nareesh trehan is a world renowned cardiovascular and cardiothoracic surgeon who has over 48000 successful open heart surgeries to his credit After practicing for 20 years in New York, he returned to India. If you take South Asia, we have Bangladesh, we have Nepal, we have Pakistan, we have uh, Sri Lanka, Maldives, all these places. Progressively India has moved up the scale to become totally international in some of the institutions. Where else Bangladesh has some which are mid you know mid level good good care now happening there nepal so is nepal so is pakistan so is sir so we are still offering the highest end of care in this whole region first in the south asia then you look at all of middle east you look at africa you look at southeast asia and you look at cis countries we are the hub for that ayurveda yoga and other wellness treatments also attracts many foreign patients Marketing Ayurveda as part of the health tourism has brought a new definition to vacationing in India itself.